Police are using drones to stop potential lewd behavior. The 19th Molly Levine is live there tonight in Barrington with the new details. Molly? Yeah, Dan and Patrice, according to police, there have been some strange things happening here at this nature preserve, which is why they're stepping up patrols. Barrington police increasing patrols at the bird sanctuary on Wampanoag Trail, Billy Veter's sanctuary of choice. I call it my sanctuary. That he visits often. He met every other day, some days, a couple days in a row. And he's experienced almost nothing but good encounters. You know, you're running some, some nice people here. Everybody's always friendly. But according to an article written by East Bay RI, there have been some unfriendly encounters. Police say there was a 50-year-old man from Charlestown taking a walk here when another man approached him and tried grabbing him inappropriately. You no, know, plus we don't want any weirdos. We've got enough of them. Which is why police say drones will be flying over the recreation area periodically and patrolmen will be making their rounds. A move, walkers say, has its pros and cons. I don't like being watched, but, uh, you know, yeah, you know, I mean, for a little while, it may be a good thing because there are people that, you know, abuse the place. Although Veter says he's only seen a few instances of bad behavior. I found a couple of beer cans, you know, picked them up. You know, I saw a campfire and somebody had lit a campfire, they must have camped out here. Adding that there can be crime at any time, so he's not against the added security measures in a place he calls his sanctuary. I come here at 5, 6 in the morning, I come here 5, 6 at night. And I did reach out to police for more information about these instances as well as the initiative. We're still waiting to hear back. I'm live from Barrington tonight, Molly Levine, NBC 10 News 19.